Hey everybody, this is the Noto. Welcome back to Minecraft. Today we are doing a hardcore playthrough. I, I decided instead of continuing the, the other one, we'd do a hardcore playthrough. So I'm excited for this. Oh my god, look at my hearts. Oh my god, that is so lucky. That is so lucky. I'm, I'm just going to fortify this village as quickly as I can. I'll need resources to fortify some of myself. Start with a stack of wood. A stack of dirt. Okay, it's the Fletcher lives here. Are there villagers? Yes, there are. Perfect. Poison. Beehive over there. Sweet. Plenty of houses so I can just see the night. So I don't have to worry about phantoms. There's no chest in these places. But. Building a perimeter is going to be really important. Like, seriously. Okay, we need food to start. No, that's just... Oh, it's a map in there, right? Not just normal paper. It takes time, but it's already filled out. That's great. Here standard houses. Yeah. Plus, we got planes here, which means I'll be able to build my base pretty close to this place. This is so close to the world spawn. Not that I'll be using the world spawn, because if you die, you die. But this is going to be a ridiculously good first attempt. Might be the last one, too. I don't know if I'm talking to people or not, because once I die, I die. Ah, for Go in. <gasps> good amounts of bread. Also, sticks. Hey, big boy. If I hit you, this runs instantly over. Let's get you out of here, bud. And in return for getting out of there, I will take your bread. And saplings. And potatoes. For planting. There's a village ends over here. Oh, never mind. There's... Path down here, covered in trees. So makes this place actually pretty dangerous. There's a pen full of trees right there, and it goes down here. Just a pointless path. Okay, so I'd say let's get started on the perimeter. Say not, not to leave trees floating. Don't worry. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Ah, frick. Start with getting stone tools. Remember, difficulty is locked at hard. And there's metal right there. Well, iron right there. I can also break this tree now. Ow! Okay, so... I'm gonna clear this forest and I'm... gonna avoid that hole. But, you know... This is awesome. It's good. This is a good spawn point, good village, but it's full of trees, which means I gotta get rid of them. 
good to see cover problems. It's good to have nice open areas. Now, my base isn't going to be in the village. I'm going to build it close to the village because trading purposes and stuff. But not in the village. And I hope they get a lot of pets, you know? Snow foxes and stuff like that. Oh yeah, this is great. Also, I build like and use the internet to create stores that really exist, like Popeyes and shit. Why not? Banner was gonna be the hardest part, though. Like a tall tree. This tree's a tall boy. Oh, I thought this tree would be a lot taller than this. Damn. <coughs> Quiet down. Oh, this village actually wraps around this place, which I like a lot. Like, it's cool. It wraps around. Oh, there's more over there. Don't die. Don't take fall damage. Don't take fall damage. Ow. Come on, kitty. Two bells! There's two bells in this village, what the hell? WTH? First farm. But two bells, what's that doing there? We got potatoes and carrots, it seems. Maybe some beets or something on that side, I'm not sure. It looks like in a little bit of a valley, which means. That's potentially dangerous, but if you if you fortify the top of the mountains, it'll be fine. Uh -huh. I should make something pretty safe. Beehive, and azure blurets, and a big flower patch over here. So, yeah. So, yeah. Oh, look at this place. I'm just wondering where to start mining. Well, first order business. Oh, frick. Should be. Let's get ourselves a fence perimeter. To keep out mobs, and then we can go mining. This is the police, what you just doing here? Oh, he's a stone cutter, okay, that's why. Yo, remember the old stone cutters? Those things were relics. Uh. Bitch. Place to have a little force to be outside of the village. Wow, I almost went into a hole. I'm so bad. Over here would be a great place for me. And I hear Zabros. Nine Circles by Zabaras. Just to trigger Justin. I have an apple, so... Oh! Bitch. Ah. I got, I got cobblestone from it. And a sapling, so... Not that bad. That's where they're coming from. Oh shit. Be out! Bitch. <laughs> Bitch. He was already injured. No way I killed him that quickly in hard difficulty.
Now, to first order of business, make. Ah, oh, you fool, retard. Hey! God, that sucks. I'm just gonna do this. Cause it's quicker. It's a good XP farmer. Fuck. Is this how I die? I already have Monster Hunter. Four humans in one day. I'll give it to him. I'm covering up the hole. Ain't no zombies gonna come get me now. Oh. Uh. Sex fences will not be nearly enough, but it's a good start. Or at least it's a start. Good is arguable. Now, that, no, I put my hand on my mouse in a weird way. Ah, uh, so, behind this house. Great. So yeah, building a fence perimeter takes a lot of, of, re of wood, mainly, but it's to protect. Now, the fence perimeter does absolutely nothing unless you light it up. This village serves one purpose. Simply to I like a mercenary. I'm just gonna live here and live off the land for as long as I need. Because I don't need to anymore, I'm gone. I'm going through my bread supplies rather quickly. Maybe a good thing it's started with mining, I'd say. And for me, this is a good little mine over here. Oh, wow. Do I have any sort of light sources? No, I don't. I found some surface coal earlier. I might, might, might go get that. Probably would have been fine if it wasn't for that goddamn cave noise. Huh. I'm not gonna take these because these lives the village on their own. And they're good. I saw a natural bit of it earlier. Don't remember where. Uh oh. Mm. Oh jeez. Do I have auto jump on? Oh no. Oh no.
Let's use a creep fall down and I'm out of that I'm out of that cave for good. I'm gonna barricade that. Hey, you. I can take the chest, but I won't. After all I am staying here, there's no point in me taking the chest. But now I can use eleven of these. I heard something. I was to that up. I should build a little base down here. Build like a bunker, a stronghold type of thing. Just... That'd be great. Mining away. Oh my god, why did I do that? I fucking messed it up. But now we have more coal for torches. And furnace fuel. Come over here. Come on. Come on over here. Corner. I was infected, bitch. I really want to torch this whole place. Torch, that is not a good word for it, but you know, still. I can see that none of that gravel is prone to falling, so. That means we're secure around here. We have note on that. I want to do a hardcore career playthrough as well. Not now, but like another time. So I'm going to remake my tools because these ones are going to make like the obvious. I'll just keep it. Now, first this can go underneath. So I have another chest, but I'm going to put the furnaces underneath. That's going to be a little compound. So I'm actually going to build fences around there. I just need some more sticks. I 
30 fences. Go bedtime. I could have split them, but you know I'm gonna sleep. Oh, that's I slept twice, which means that's day three. Hold up. Um. Okay, we're we're on day three now. I forgot to count. That could have been bad. I think I have enough to just keep going. And down here, there's no point in keep on going because you know it's like this. But I think I'm gonna build a little stronghold down here. Clear it out, make it all stone. The turret stone, get rid of the diorite and stuff. Smooth that out and build a little stronghold. But for now, I have a feeling we're gonna use this. Now these actually not can cook these right, like right now. Try to wait a little bit. I like to make an iron pickaxe before I depart. Ooh, I'm just gonna go over there and check on the little farm. I should come do that and come back. See what see what they've been doing. Be that back. There's two bells, so it's probably two villages. <laughs> I'm kidding. I think it was an iron golem there. That's why I posted him there, because I was like, okay, that place is dangerous. I need a bottle to look like that shit. <gasps> There's wheat ready. Ow. Or is that not that's not ready yet? It's also some, got some green about it. Mm. Oh! Never mind, it's it's ready. You can dig jump on these things and it's so annoying. I'm not sorry, bro. <gasps> oh, that's really good. That's He's an amazing villager. I want to keep him here, but I don't have emeralds. Uh, I don't have enough potatoes to block his trades. That's what they are. So sucks. I wonder if I just up the tick speed. Huh. 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 I can jump farther than you can. Huh. You might stop giving the, heart, the farmer a heart attack. Uh. Oh, yeah, I'm in dire need of food. If one emerald like it's gonna give me bread. I could be living off bread. Like that's amazing. This is an amazing starter world like for my first um hardcore run. Twenty six Bam. Potatoes in there and first order of business is to make an iron pickaxe and an iron sword. I need protection and I also need Good stuff for resource gathering. Twenty one left, okay. He's probably under a tree. Skeleton fucker. That sounds papyrus, he's like now those two are good, but that, this skeleton I bet is bad, so 
I just kind of want some more food before I head down to the mine. Uh, okay, check this house. No, I did. Right, there's one left. Can't chant that later on. Yep, he's right there. Make sure you go over there and just take some crops every now and again. It's a, that's a good plan, so... I'd say it's a good thing to do. Some people might not. It's not a bad place to have trees. I actually like them here, so. Yeah, it's great. My friend, like, failed this hardcore playthrough of the game because there's a thing in in Java where you just, you know how there's, like, it could be, I don't know why I planted that there, where they can just have a ran, randomly, they can just horde of zombies, like, as well, like a massive horde. That's what killed him. I knew the notable had one of those, but it was drowned instead. I, those are arguably more scary. <gasps> Turtle! <gasps> and this is their home beach! Yes! Okay, I'm gonna put some torches, like... Oh, wow. The game was experiencing some issues there. Those torches are to mark off as a turtle home beach. I can get a helmet now. Y'all know how good my avatar looks in netherite armor from the creative playthroughs and the snapshots. Can't wait. So you're probably done. Yeah, yes you are. Okay. That's our current food source, and we're going to have to take care of a skeleton. Ow. Oh, fucker. Uh, wrong way. I do this. Sounds like a terraria noise. I don't think the skeleton creep can get through this, I don't think. So. Ooh, I should not waste that on this. They're now locked in there. It's hard because it's downwards going cave, so I kind of want to just... They just... Make the stairs. Oh, it's not going to be clean. This is hardcore, I'm gonna play it like an absolute pussy. Ah, oh, this is dead end. 
Get a bit of iron out of it, though. To go through the arrow again. I wish you guys bring back. This is bring back two and a half like bread does, but I'm not sure. So, uh, mm, this is just exposed stone. There's not enough. So, unless they bring back three, then I'm cor correct so far. Now, tree farm has started, so might as well start. Mining these now. That's jolly music for a game that it it's easy to die in, but if you die once, it's all over. Now, the first few days are always the hardest. Okay, if I go on really long mining sessions, how will I know if it's day or night? That's just bruh. <laughs> when you get some good achievements, that's a uh... so nine plus eight, seventeen plus seven. You need twenty four for a full set. I'm three off. If I hadn't made that pickaxe, I'd have been fine. <laughs> I'll make the breastplate. Huh. Eh, threw it on the ground. Great. Huh. Oh, I could have made the full set. Eh, yeah, well. But good thing we're clo we're next to the ocean. That's something I always like being close to the ocean. Oh, you right click. <laughs> Forgot about that. Bam. Trees planted. Thanks, Mom, for starting the blender. <laughs> if I can hurt my ears. I'll, I already have a headache, which sucks. I honestly had a sort of like a constant in my life. That's good. The bunker is gonna have three layers of doors. I have an axe, why am I not using it? Uh. Now this bunker won't actually have ground cable or anything inside of it. It's only gonna be storage and like a bed. For emergencies, for emergencies. I was about to make that. Like, <laughs> okay. 
Uh, what was I making? Right. Yeah, so you better not make just one. Could you imagine how grindy that would be? Uh, the walls will be turned entirely to stone. Except for, like, the first entryway. At this point forward, it will entirely be... What do you call it? Stone. I'll be wood anyway, so it doesn't matter. Now the entrance are going to be pretty flammable, so if you really want to get in, you can just use fire. Or you can just use the door. It's not locked. Um, in here, I want to. didn't want to dump in here. Nope. I want to check on the farm, though. Good to know, they use the same as potatoes. No, this won't actually be a wall right here. This is going to be a wall. So, yeah. Perfect fit. But not anywhere wood. Please don't just break for the last one. Uh, figures. If you play a survival game, that shit always happens. This is Terraria, because you don't. This is Terraria, because then, you know. You know. <laughs> I'm trying to think of the words. I have a headache right now, it cannot be helping. I just developed a migraine. Probably from lack of water. <laughs> I'll leave this once this room's been entirely transformed. Apparently Justin's mom freaked out when she when she found out he was gay. Good freak out. I found that quite entertaining. I was like, <laughs> "Unless he rushed to tell his dad." So that was making shit on the barbecue. So I don't think Justin got his reaction. But you know, still hilarious. I'm gonna need more planks and doors. And also So I'd much rather the sunk in look, so Ah, uh, much better. That's oblong, but who really cares? I could do this. Yep, that looks better. <laughs> One just makes it so that it'll automatically stack there. I'm not all the trees that are around here, they're potential dangers because under them, obviously, why not? Apple! 
And now the funniest thing you've ever seen from really far away. Apples! I, I didn't want to do the little mumbling arguing. Oh, doing it that way just feels weird. Yeah, that is good for you. And I'm gonna do a lot of my tree planting outside of the barrier because, as I said, it they're kind of safe, but also not because you know, decorate decorative ones are always safe because then you're almost guaranteed to put torches on them. But like farm ones, we don't because you're gonna break them. That's good. That that little island's gonna be useful. But there's a turtle home beach right there, so yeah, that's great. Oh, it's almost day four. Uh, day four, and we've got ourselves a little smeltering stuff. It's great. All of them is going to be a completely unedited series. Man, it's because that takes up less computer space. I think. Not that I'm really in need of any. I still have 700 gigabytes storage left. Oh, that's going to be inside the perimeter. Who cares? I like I'm building it now. I've claimed this house is my own. By the way, I just at this point I have. So yeah, and plus having an armor score in hardcore is very important. Hey, bro. I'm just trying to go look for clay. Now I think they only spawn in riverbeds, but if they spawn in the ocean, that'll be good because then I could build that guy up. Plus emeralds, I can buy bread with that from the, from the farmer. <gasps> Farmer, get back here. Uh -huh. I have two emeralds. That's good. I mean, sure, clay is a limited resource, but you know. I had a cave. Yeah, I think that's, that's the cave noise, and it's the train whistle, I believe, that, that's what that one is. Oh, those over there are breeding. At least they were. Are you that farmer that gives me the epic deal? One night, one emerald for six bread? Yes, it is. <laughs> now it's treasure locked. I love that. Well, if he doesn't die, we, we're good. Yeah. Right, bro, sorry. Yeah. I can take care of it, bud. Uh oh, he don't work here. Oh, I can yeah. buy stone tools off this guy. Yeah. I don't know why I would, but I kid. It's not like stone tools. Then again, you are an armor smith, so I could get diamond shit out of you eventually. Yeah. Can I? Or is it just engendered stuff? Either way. <laughs> Can't use those yet, but you can still get a Fletcher, and then, oh, oh, that's cool. I mean, sure, it's pointless, but that's cool. Why not, buddy? Okay, let's consider this the first emerald I ever made, okay? Let's keep that in the chest, and we're not we're never going to sell that one or transform it. That one emerald, it's always that one I'm going to keep. Mm-hmm. <laughs> 
Actually, I'll do a bit of natural terror, a bit of artificial terraforming. Yes, because it's going to be weird otherwise. Oh, there it's just the bad height, too. Right. I mean, need a wood. Also, in need of some terraforming. Oh God. Um. Be there for now. And just. And bam! Now with that out of the way, I can top off the splits in here, I guess. I put one more anti-science stuff and seeds in there. Just supplies, and, you know. For now, I don't need that, so there's no point in keeping it. This water bucket's gonna be useful later, but not now. And we're really good for now. I think I'll leave it here. We're at four days. So I'm going to change my Google Docs, but that's it for, the, for, the, for, the, today, for today's episode. Yes, I'll be doing these daily. Okay, yeah, because I was realized, oh no, daily? That's going to take forever. I'm going to play this a lot more than that. But yeah, see you all next time. Bye.